Hi everybody, this is Guy Gilchrist. Now, we're at, right here at Big Frog Headquarters. And today, though, we're not going to be drawing frogs or pigs or even Rolf. Rolf the dog here, but we are going to draw a dog. Okay, um, uh, a lot of you know me as Jim Henson's cartoonist, but I'm also the illustrator of a brand new book. It's called Monster Dance. It has some copies of some of the pages right here. And I wanted to show you how I draw some of my characters in Monster Dance and give you a chance to draw your own little girls, little boys, dogs, and monsters. Okay? Okay. So we're going to come around and you're going to watch me over my shoulder. Okay? Okay. So, I got to put my glasses on because I'm old. Okay, and now I'm going to show you first how I draw little Charlie. Okay, Charlie is our girl. Now, you guys may have pencils, crayons, and stuff. Uh, what I use is I use a pencil, and I'm going to use a colored pencil this time, so hopefully it shows up good for you on the video. And then we're going to use a pen because I draw out first and then I ink it. Inking means that we use ink on top, okay? And then later on, you guys could erase it if that's what you want to do. But what I'm going to do, drawing Charlie, and see, here's Charlie right here. See, there's Charlie, and she's doing the monster dance with the monsters, okay? So let's draw Charlie. So when I draw Charlie, I start off, with a circle, like that, see? And then I put another smaller circle, like that. Then I'm gonna put two lines there. Maybe I'll have her drawing, since we're all drawing, okay? Let's have her drawing. See, so there's a circle there, and then there's this line Oh, she's got little skinny arms, okay? And there's another. Those are going to be her hands. You know, when we draw hands, it's kind of like a mitten, right? Okay, what goes in the middle of the two eyes? That's right. There's a little circle for the nose. Now, are eyes square or oval shaped? They're oval shaped. That's right. Almost like an almond, look. See? Like an almond shape. Now, underneath your eyes is a cheek. And what's under the, what's right under here? That's right. Now, I'm going to make her happy. You can do anything you want. Now, I think I'm going to have her looking right at what she's drawing. You notice that I'm drawing very, very light, okay? And I'm going to draw her hair. And you see, I don't draw all, every tiny little hair like that. I draw the hair like it's a wave. Oh, we need ears to hear with, don't we? <gasps> Almost forgot the ears. Okay. And here's my piece of paper and your piece of paper. Now... I'm going to take this, and this is just a pen. There's nothing fancy about it. And now I'm going to draw Charlie. Charlie is being safe, and she's home, so she's not wearing a mask. You could have her make, wear a mask, though. It's okay. I'm going to draw her kind of fast. Because you know what? This is on film for you. So you know what you get to do. You can rewind this and watch it over and over and over again. If you want to. And Charlie has medium long hair and it's dark 
I'm not going to do the dark part. Or maybe you can talk me into it. I don't know. I'll put an ear. You see what I'm doing is I'm following my shapes that I drew underneath. And then I'm picking where I want to put my lines. Now I know I draw kind of fancy and maybe you don't. But the thing about drawing is however you draw, it's great. I'm glad that you're trying because trying is the most important thing. It doesn't really matter how great it comes out. I mean, it's great if it comes out great. But the most important thing is that you're trying. Okay? Okay. Now, let's give her a little turtle neck. See, so there was her neck. And now I'm going to do sort of a little collar. See? Now, remember what this was? This is her hand. And when we look at a hand, we see lots of fingers, right? Holding what we're drawing with. So I'm going to do those fingers. There we go. One, two, three, four. And the thumb is in back. See, we can't see it. See, it's like that. And maybe she has a crayon, let's just say. Maybe she has a crayon that she's drawing with. And I think I'll give her a short sleeve shirt because that's what I'm wearing today. So there's her arm and it's bent at the elbow. And then on top of it, I'm drawing a short sleeve, see? So what are we going to do over here? Well, we're going to do a hand that kind of looks like that, okay? So it's going to go little finger, first finger there, maybe a thumb there. See, holding the paper. There's part of her arm. And remember, she has short sleeves. And there she is doing a piece of paper. And I think she's drawing you. Come on, Charlie. That doesn't look like them. Does too. She's just starting. See? Hmm. Now, if you want to, you can go in get fancy and if you have a black crayon or something you could do it even faster lots faster than me see I have a skinny 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 little pen and I'm gonna see how I'm making all my lines go in one direction see it kind of looks like all the hair is going in one direction right so, there's Charlie and we spell Charlie The hearts just because of me and then I'm going to sign this and I think you should all sign your work. You should be happy and proud that you just did that. Well, I hope you, that you enjoyed this little lesson and the book again, Kermit, are you listening? Oh, yes. Okay. Um, is called Monster Dance.